Hello, dear viewers, welcome to Bull Brezza. If you're into electric vehicles, today's video is one you won't want to miss. We're diving deep into the latest updates about Nikola Corporation. The future is electric, and Nikola is one of the companies at the forefront. But like any trailblazer, they've had their shares of peaks and valleys. Let's unpack it all. For those just tuning in or needing a refresher, Nikola specializes in heavy-duty commercial battery electric vehicles. Think big trucks with electric vibes. Now, here's where the plot thickens. Nikola's stock took a tumble in pre-market trading recently. The cause? They've announced plans to offer a sizable $325 million in senior convertible bonds. Breaking down the numbers, they're aiming for an initial bond sale of about $125 million. The expected net cash from this, a close $124.5 million. That's cutting it tight. But hold on, that's just one part of the story. Nikola has also recalled over 200 of its electric vehicles. This move has eyebrows raised and questions flying. The big concern is the financial strain and its ripple effects. Such a significant recall has consequences. With production uncertainties for their battery electric trucks, may are wondering about Nikola's next steps. Yet, every cloud has a silver lining. Nikola might be pausing their battery electric vehicle sales, but they're not out. Their hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicles are pushing forward unfazed. So, what triggered the recall? An investigation found a likely culprit in a coolant leak within a battery pack, which unfortunately led to a fire incident at Nikola's Phoenix base. In the midst of these developments, there's more. Kerry Mendes, the mind behind Nikola's hydrogen venture, has resigned. This leaves a significant leadership gap and us all wondering who's up next. With this whirlwind of events, it's clear that Nikola is at a crossroads. As they handle these hurdles, the industry watches closely. Let's quickly dive into the latest buzz around Nikola's stock trading activity on August 21, 2023. A notable put option sweep that leans bearish. The expiration. It's coming up in just 11 days on September 1st. The significant event saw a transfer of 3,338 contracts at a $1.50 strike. Interestingly, this had to be split into 52 different trades to get fully processed. The writing parties pocketed a cool $70.4,000, costing buyers $21 per contract. For context before today, 6,288 contracts were open at this strike. And today, a whopping 27,047 contracts exchanged hands. Before we wrap up, remember, this video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. Always do your own research and consult with a professional before making any investment decisions. The world of electric vehicles is dynamic and ever-evolving. As Nikola charts its path, we'll be right here, giving you the latest.